Hello, my good afternoon. Good afternoon, my dear. How are you? Very fine. Okay, my name is Toby. I'm coming from Celebrity and Lifestyle Media, okay? Um, You're welcome. Please, I'm actually working on the Celebrity and Lifestyle Media social media platform. We have social media platforms all over the world. But please, my dear, there's some few questions I like to ask you and what probably you might want the government to do in this your location, or ever state government precisely. But please, my first, before we go into that, please, what's your name? Okay, I'm Madam Favor. Madam Favor? Yes. Okay, you sell in this market? Yes. Okay, with your few time of being here, are you a native of this community? Well, I'm from River City, but I'm not from this community. Okay. Mondone. Okay, you're from Mondone? Yes. Oh, okay. Oh, so, my please, um, in just a few minutes, I'd like you to please tell me what do you think about Nigerian economy in general? Well, it's affecting each and every one of us. Okay. As you can see, normally before we pay to Onicha, 5,000 naira, but now it's 10,000 naira. So it's really telling on us. We need government intervention to reduce everything so that we can cope. As I'm talking to you, it is not in six money. I'm in this market. You can see I'm feeling a this melon. No markets. We are just managing. Government should come and help us. And another thing, I want state government to fasten up this market so that we can pack in and see if we can uh, start from where we stop. But it's really telling on us, honestly. Okay. Okay. Yes. Okay, I heard you say, um, talk about the transportation. Yes. Okay, so where do you normally go to buy these goods from? Yeah, we normally go to Onicha. Okay. And, Aba, yes. and what was the transportation like before, before now? Before it was two five. And then now, how much is it? Now it's five thousand. Being a farmer, that is ten thousand. Why before it was being a farmer five thousand? So it's telling on us. Okay, so what what do you think? What do you think can actually help us to come out of this? Well, we have president. Yes, our president should look down and hear our cry. We are suffering. So that he should reduce everything. It is his hand to do it. He can do it. He should come for our rescue. We are suffering. Everybody. So he should reduce even the cost of fuel because it's fuel that made us to pay uh, 5,000 naira instead of 2 five. When the fuel, when he reduced the fuel subsidy, after it, everything will move fine. Look at rice now. Bag of rice is something thousand instead of 40,000. It's telling on us. Wow. That is it. Okay, so in this environment, I understand, um, you know, I've had a lot of individuals complaining on, more especially the, the, the nature of the things going on over here in respect of the roads. Some persons are also complaining that Omok Road is not good. What do you think you can actually do as part of River State? What do you think River State government can do to help this particular location, Omok? Uh, River State uh, government, they should do the road well. At least when you are coming from Potakot, you know that at least the road is good. No matter the time that you leave Potakot, you know that the road is good. It should not affect us. Yes. At least we have governor. He can do it. Yes. All right, all right. Um, I want to say thank you so much. Thank you very much. Okay, my please, for the last time, please, um, I want you to please repeat your name for the audience. Well, I'm Madam Favor. It's so no. Okay, all right. Thank I'm you very much for your time. Thank you. Thank nice to meet you.